Okay, this is the 1994 Jeep Wrangler. I've lowered the price on it. I changed out the ramps and tires. It's about a 37 inch Pro Comp, 35 inch, I don't know how to read it. It's LT31575 R16. Same kind of aluminum rims, a little different. Uh, I wanted the other ones for my other Jeep. Uh, I'm just going to sell this one. Anyway, this is an engine cowling that's cut into the hood. It's actually it's actually serviceable. It's got holes cut into it. It's not just for looksies. Nice front bumper. Uh, rims are nice. Two front tires are better than the back tires. But I don't know how much life they got on. Goes down the road pretty straight. You know, way tighter than my other Jeep. Got a nice um, family roll cage. It's got the rear tire release right there. That just swings out. And that's from four wheeler supply, I think. Four wheelers. Back door works good. Uh, it's carpeted in here. It's got the lock boxes in the back on the sides. And there's speakers up in here on each side. And these both work. They're lockable. Back seat's not bad. There's the interior. Except for my jacket. There's cup holders on the center console thing. Um, right now I'm about 5,500 for it. I'll take it. The visor, it's a five speed. And this thing here is the only thing that's missing a lock is this one. And then that's for stereo. Another CB it does have a stereo in it. It works. Um, the doors are all nice. Interior's not bad. I don't know how good you're seeing it with the sun. Um, close the back back up. It's got a tow hitch on it. I've never towed anything with it. Straight six to underneath. It looks like it's had some work done on it. So I don't know. Um, it says 185,000 miles on the speedometer. And then it starts right up, fuel injected, like that stuff. Uh, well, you can see it's pretty clean under the hood. It's set up for AC. The AC goes right here, but it's, this one isn't set up for the AC, but it can be. You can put it right on. It's got an air aid, air intake. Uh, has aftermarket. That's a pretty nice little system right here. The way it goes in the air aid. Brakes work good. Starts right up. I don't overheat. Uh, like I said, the hood it has the holes cut in it. Um, just a clean looking Jeep all around. Got a skid plate on the bottom there. Everything's pretty tight on it. Uh, it's got all new rubbers. I don't know if you can see it here. Those are all new rubbers right there. Everything's all new. Been totally redone. Uh, pop it into gear. So pop it out of gear. <laughs> here it runs. Tires right up. No problems whatsoever. Good runner. This Jeep, 5500 out the door with the lock boxes. The way she sits, it's a good deal. I believe she's got at least a new head on her. She might have the whole motor rebuilt, but I don't know. I wouldn't swear to it. I didn't do all the work on it. Uh, that's it. Give me a call, 928-925-2275. Sorry, no still shots. I don't know if I'm going to have enough camera left to get this video. I'll put this on YouTube and then uh, it's a good walk around. Body straight, you know, nice paint. It's a good looking Jeep. You will not be, it'll be hard to find a better Jeep. As clean as this one is, you know. And there might be better out there, but <laughs> you're going to pay a lot more than that. Anyway, have a good day. Give me a call. Not really looking for any trades. Thank you. 928-925-2275. Bye.